today, we are going to learn how to install Wi-Fi plug-in in a SolarEdge inverter with a display and LCD buttons in two steps. Installation and Configuration In this movie, we will install the Wi-Fi plug-in in a single-phase inverter with HD Wave technology. However, the installation sequence is identical also for other inverter models, though the hardware may look different. Let's start with a short introduction. Wi-Fi plug-in enables connecting a SolarEdge inverter to the SolarEdge monitoring platform. Multiple inverters can be wirelessly connected to the monitoring platform by installing Wi-Fi plug-in in each inverter for a fully wireless system or they can be connected in an RS-485 bus with Wi-Fi plug-in only in the master inverter. The Wi-Fi plug-in contains Wi-Fi card, antenna with RF cable, two cable ties, an SD card, and the installation guide. Install the Wi-Fi card during inverter installation when the inverter cover is off. If you are adding the Wi-Fi card later, make sure to turn off the inverter. Switch off the on-off switch at the bottom of the inverter, wait 5 minutes, and then switch off the AC breaker. To open the cover, loosen all six Allen screws. Let's install the antenna. Attach the antenna clip to the inverter heatsink fins. Route the cable along the back or side of the inverter and insert the cable through the communication gland at the bottom of the inverter. In the next step, we connect the Wi-Fi card to the communication board. Use the marking on the communication board to plug in the card with the correct orientation. Route the cable along the communication board side and connect it to the Wi-Fi card. Use the two cable ties to tighten the cable to the communication board. For single-phase inverter with HD Wave technology, cover the inverter and close all six Allen screws and turn the AC breaker on. Wi-Fi plug-in installation is complete. Please join us in the next clip where we will show you how to configure the Wi-Fi.